Louis, congratulations, the winning goal today, and you've scored at the Cheadle end. Tell us about it. Yeah, I'm buzzing with it. Um, I think, I think the last few games have been has been have been tough for me and the team. I think we deserve to have way more points than what we do, and have scored more. I think we've been a bit unlucky, um, even in the first half. I think we should be in, come in the first half two three nil. Some of uh, some to do with us, some to do with the ref. I feel. Um, but yeah, that that uh, that we, I think for the second half we became very attackive. Um, we were looking for that first goal, and luckily it was me that managed to break the deadlock with a bit of luck. But I think it's going in the top corner anyway. Yeah, so, of course it is. So. I mean, even in the first half, you've you've had a great opportunity. And as I was watching, it's, it, it's hard. I've I've looked back at it, and it's it's difficult to tell from the camera angle whether it's a penalty or not. Having said that, if it's not a penalty, you presumably would stay on your feet, would you? Um, yeah. So. Last season, I think the main thing for me was uh, I wasn't shooting enough. Yeah. Um, so this, the first half, uh, I, when I went through one on one, I think take away the risk, I should have just shot anyway. But at saying that, I've went around the keeper. Mm -hmm. It's an easy tapping for me. I have to forget to the ball. I felt a big push on my back, and I went down. Haven't dived. Haven't me meant to go down. He just pushed me in the back. Um, why would I go down in that situation? Yeah. I'm through one on one. I went around the keeper. I'm about to slide home. Um, I think that was a big call from the ref. I felt like it was a penalty. I haven't seen it back, but from the force that I felt, I think it's a penalty all day long. Um, but yeah, Gaffer's just been saying to us he, he kind of tweaked things a little bit today. Tell us about how that impacted on you and your and your role in the team today because you were in a really aggressive position today. Yeah, I enjoyed it. Um, I think. I like I like getting the ball and going one on one at players. Um, I feel like also out of possession, I was locking onto the defensive midfielder, which I like as well, mm. because I'm in. If I'm out of possession, I'm in a position where if they lose it, I'm straight on goal. Um, so I enjoyed that, and obviously changed a bit. Went from, went to strike. I went to left wing, um, and I'm. I say I'm quite a versatile player. So um, wherever he wants me to play, I'll play. Um, but yeah, I enjoyed it. I, I enjoyed the game today. I've enjoyed every game since I've been here with the, uh, with the gaffer. I feel like it really helps me cool. have freedom, yeah. per se, um, so I can get on the ball deep. To be fair, I feel like in the first half I was being a bit too deep because then I try, I'd have to go around five, six players to try and get a position. So I think in the second half I stayed a bit higher. Mm. That's how I got my goal. I was, in the, I was in the box and took a punt and obviously winning. So yeah. Tell us a bit about, I mean, for a young man, you're 20 years of age and, and I'm thinking about the moving around the country you've had to do just in the last couple of years. I mean, you, the loan spell at MK, uh, which you had then obviously Salford, now here for a season. Tell us about that, because adapting to new surroundings and new personnel and new teammates at the age of 20 is quite a, quite a big ask. Yeah, I think since I've turned 18, I've been on five loans. Yeah. Um, that shows, uh, I feel like that shows for me that I'm not scared. Mm. I'm not scared to go in the deep end and, and try. I feel like I've had a few good loans, um, bar one, by the first one. I wasn't really ready for men's football, mm. I don't think. Um, but now I've got the know-how of how to play in, 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 in men's football. Um, and yeah, I feel like the main thing for me is the stats. I, I, my whole career, youth career, I was a goal scorer. Mm. Um, so I feel like the last two few seasons, I think I need to get the stats up, which is the main thing. I was playing well, but I just wasn't getting the goal or assist. So that's why I've come here now. I feel like this team can really help me get the stats up and play well. And, and yeah, I'm just buzzing for the rest of the season. Now I'm off the mark, so confidence is really high. So yeah. Yeah, the gaff was kind of saying that because I, I guess back in the day when you were you were playing as a kid, you were beating seven or eight players and whacking it in the top corner at Barcelona or wherever you, you played. Tell us a bit about that as an upbringing as well. How was that? Yeah, it was that was crazy. I uh, haven't really digested it yet, yeah. to be fair, because it's only a few. Because you won ago. the La Liga youth title when you were there. Yeah, 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 yeah. and I've played in the uh, UEFA youth league, which is a really good experience. Um, I feel like when I went there, it was it was just crazy to me the social media and everything. Yeah. And then the reason for coming back was um, just wanting to be at home. But if I look back on it now, I feel I think I should have gave it a real go. But you know, I went. I wouldn't have went anywhere else except Villa because yeah. that's my home club team. It's cleaned since I supported since I was six years old. They came in for me and it was a no-brainer because I'm back at home. I'm yeah. playing for the team I love. And if I didn't do that, I wouldn't have the experiences I've had there. So, yeah, I've, I've, I have no regrets.
Have you got good family and friends supporting you wherever you go on loan? Do they come and watch you? Yeah, I've got a big. My dad's here every single game. Great. I think you could probably, I, think I could hear him when I scored. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I've got a massive. Yeah, I've got a massive. I've obviously got a girlfriend who supports me a lot. Brilliant. Um, I've got family. I've had millions of messages. Even I think within seconds of me scoring, they all watch it at home if they can't come. So yeah, I've, um, I've really enjoyed it. They really helped me and I've really enjoyed it here and they've enjoyed coming. Superb. Yeah. Well, listen, we've enjoyed watching you today and what a mo what moment to get you, your first goal for County, yeah, yeah. the winner in a game like this and, and at the Shield end as well. The fans absolutely swamped you, didn't they? Yeah, yeah. Fans have been brilliant since I've been here. They've, they've really helped me from the first game. So yeah, yeah I just want to say thank you for that. Top man. Bless you. Well Cheers. done. Thank Thanks you. ever so much. Cheers, Cheers. Louis.